Welcome to my AID tutorial 20.1. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add web view, how to add progress bar in your web view application. First, go to AID, create a, create a new project, type web view one. I'll name the project at web name and package name web view one click and create first of all change the linear layout to frame layout give it id lsn id fl then change the text view to web view And remove the text field and give it an also ID I'll give you ID web then copy this code and change the web content to match parent both then add a progress bar to the application give it id pb and then paste the width and height change it add a gravity add it to the center by using gravity layouts underscore gravity equals to center yes it is done then go to activity the java Now create a private field to all three web view. We have a send ID web, then private frame layout. We have a send ID FL again private add progress bar pb then good here now we will add find view by id for all three web equals to bracket start web view find bvid find bvid r dot id dot web then frame layout fl fl equals to bracket start frame frame layout bracket find view by id r dot id dot fl now progress bar pb equals to bracket start progress bar bracket find view id assign the id ir dot id dot pb then we'll give a url to the web view application 
first of all web start web setting web settings web settings equals to web dot web dot dot get settings again web settings dot set javascript enable is true close the back it then add url web dot load url start bracket in butter comma http is to slash slash same comment i'll add my blog sport.com you can add any of your website then set a web client this will load your application web view in your own application not in the browser new web view client start a curly bracket here after loading your web view we need to add remove the progress bar so let's remove it at the rate override type public void on page finished then type web view view add bracket add comma string URL close bracket and start another curly bracket then type fl dot remove view view and type pv after loading web view this frame layout will remove the progress bar now go to your application and here in android manifest we need to add a user's permission of internet for this app to use the internet of your t mobile phone you can add permission in two way either you can add before application here or after application in this tutorial i'll add uh, user's permission after the the application let's type it uses this permission android is to name equals to start 
Android dot permission dot internet. This app has taken the permission of internet. Now click and build. Here you can see the device access network communication allows the app to create network sockets and use customized network protocol the browser and other applications provide the means to send data to the internet to set this permission so this permission is re not required to send data to the internet click on install click on open now here you can see the progress bar here we have the progress bar is removed after the page load now click on this article we have enabled javascript so you can see the videos here directly and add and other things now you can directly play here If you do not like to enable JavaScript, you can type here false. Thanks for watching.